Okay, so once now you have your truck, you're gonna import your file, which is gonna be in here. So you need to scale it to get correct size, but just because I am real, really risky, I just make the animations for some reason first. So export setting, and then we're gonna do toad circuit. Make sure model and texture data is on. I accidentally closed that. I have to reopen that because it won't import correctly. For some reason, sometimes it doesn't import correctly, so. Okay, we now have our model. So, we got it in here. We got the stuff. If you don't know something. Okay. It'll look kind of weird, but it's just for a test, so it's fine. You could fix that later. So what we need to do is, um, first of all, let's fix the mushroom house. Actually, let's just, okay, it's on transparency already. So we need to do mirror and mirror. Oh, I didn't even pay attention to the poly count. Okay, it's fine. And then for this one, mirror, mirror. Okay, we got the houses now. There's a little shortcut right there, and then boost panels. My favorite. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna actually. So, what I like to do, I don't have it. So, I have a folder uh, for this in here. So, GBA Snowland, I had it. We're gonna import some boost textures, which I'll link in the description. So, here. Yeah. And then we'll do texture O, texture one, and then A plus B, and then bam, you got your import in. It's imported in. So then the textures, I'm gonna put the scale by four. Actually, no, three. Three will be good. And um, before we get to the animations, I need to make this tree not do this every time. here so we need to turn off turn on display both faces and that will show correctly okay we got that cool let's import let's do the anime oh yeah one more thing um so uh, uh so here we have every file explorer and we f if we open a file like uh let's use my my JVS no land example we can export the material settings into a folder like this so and then you can export them and then you can grab stuff like this so I'm gonna um for the water load in the material so water but you you don't have a texture you say well you can use the old texture for now but I'll show what you can do later so this I know hold on Let's not use this material. Let's use a different material. So you can export from any track you like, basically. So, okay. Matt. There, and then... Okay, so I have a water texture right here. Let me just delete these files. So, so you do Snowland and then MT underscore water. I will, I'll link some of the C text files in the description. And 
and bam, we have the Market 7 water. And so we animate this by going in here, do this, add zero. There's also a tutorial on the Market 7 modding page. So go 360, three, actually no, 960 by eight. Uh, those are just for st tracks that water because easier that way. I'm gonna put this on all of them. And bam, the water animation works, but it doesn't loop. So what we do here is we do this by 960 at a loop. And then uh, for the boost panel texture, I have to really quickly animate that. Here. Nine sixty and bam, your objects are animated. How? I don't know. <laughs> okay, so we got that, and now we can try this in game. So we're gonna we're gonna find our custom tracks folder, which is a custom track tutorial. Uh, track and and uh, make sure your textures are good size because. Sometimes it might not work if, if it's like really high, like that texture. Let me check the file size. Yeah, that's a huge file. So what we're gonna do is, uh, hold on, I gotta be off camera for one second. Okay, so now we can, oh, we have, we have to use Photoshop and we gotta, um, so I'll make a folder for the CMDL. Always cat keep backups of your tracks, by the way. So we're gonna save files and then bam in there. And then, so we're gonna in load all the textures except the boost panels in the water because I already had mip mip maps of those. And then we're gonna open the ten textures. Okay, so we're gonna start this one. We're gonna add mip maps to all of them. Okay, and bam we have all the textures added to mip maps so how do you turn this on actually so I got all of this here use a mip map you gotta enable it there Okay. So, i and now we can um on the touch the time mark just be asking me to do this I'm going to hate you just don't need to do this Later we will, but not right now. So we're gonna file, save binary, track. Okay, that looks way better. So now we're gonna open the toad circuit file.
And we got our track file in here. So now we need to make the key seal, which I'm just gonna make right now, so. So we don't need leaves, but we do need the trees and uh, we don't need the audience. And hold on. Let's make this really quickly. Okay, so. Wall. Just delete those. Where's this file at? Oh, that's the start line. So I'll just make this road. Uh, this will be sticky road, by the way. So. This will be boost. Road. Grass off road. Rock wall. And water. Let's also make a fall, fall boundary right here. So we're gonna, uh. Okay. Okay, so file export FBX as KCL. Also, it's very important to have consistent folders of what you have it named as because I keep forgetting to. KCL. Let's make a new folder, KCL. Mark plugin, mark it seven KCL. Okay, so boost, fall, out of bounds, air, grass off road. It's gonna be obviously grass off road. Road. Uh, sticky rock wall. Rock wall. Water. Water. Um, hold on. Out of balance. Water. You don't have the need to have any. Particle effect like in Marker Wii, so and then wood wall. So we got that. I'm gonna save the KCL and then we're gonna go into the next part.